Hi there, this is me, Seth, from macosxscreencasts.com. Today I'm going to show you a new application for your Mac. It is currently in version 0.2.8 and it needs Mac OS 10 5 or later to run. It costs only 10 bucks and it is called DropZone. DropZone comes as a dock application and when you, once you click it, you find some actions yeah, that this application can run, like zip a mail, share text, uh, or, or install an application. You can go to the preferences of this application, click Add, and there you find some more destinations you can add, like Flickr, Upload, FTP Upload, Install an Application, Move Files, Open an Application, Save Text, Share Text, or zip a mail again. Um, if you want more actions, you may click this more action button here or you can go to the website and click this extend button here and there you find some drag or drop destinations uh, users have provided like this ISGD uh, action here. You can click it and then a download starts. Once it's being downloaded, I have to previously chosen to uh, download the image shack drop zone you just double click it then you can auto add it to your grid or you can just hit ok button the ok button the ok button and then it will be added to the settings tab here under the installed destination scripts now i will stop a few seconds and install some more um, drop zones and then i will get back to you Okay, now I've uh, installed some more drag destinations uh, like image check, Flickr upload, I've installed my uh, FTP upload, uh, Twipic, Twipic and some more. And I will show you some of them now. Let's say I want to share a screenshot with someone. I have multiple options like hmm, something from our own website is macosxscreencast.com and I want to share this one's very pretty cool and I just select it with my um, screenshot tool something will be saved onto my desktop drop it onto drop zone then all my actions pop up I can drop it onto the image check then it will ask for internet access I will I will grant internet access and once it's uploaded, I hear a, s a sound. This one takes a while. And I have the URL to the picture, the full screen URL to the picture on my clipboard, which I can share with friends and such. Or I have some other uh, options like FTP upload. This is pretty the same, but with my uh, own web space. And there I have a subfolder, which is called Drop Zone, where I put those files I want to share with other users. I can twip pick this picture, I can upload it to Flickr, or I can set it as a desktop picture. If I want to... Um, share links let's say to our team um, URL here with some other persons I just grab it from the URL section from Safari drag it onto drop zone drop it on um, the isgd URL here my isgd URL will be uh, copied to clipboard I can paste it and boom I am again on my on our sorry team page um, I can s sh uh, set my Mac to sleep now. I can uh, copy the current uh, terminal path of a file I'm dragging onto the onto this destination to the clipboard and some other things. If you want to customize these destinations, you can. One way would be to go on your already installed destination, hit the edit button and there you can set some um, information like set a new icon, 
new name or a different action which will be run. Or if you are really geeky, you can go to the settings tab, go to the uh, go to your um, already installed destination, hit the edit button, then your favorite text editor will come up, and on the upper s in the upper section here you will find some so-called metadata like this icon URL which uh, you saw before. This one will be downloaded when you hit, hit the get icon uh, button. And below you find the script which will get called if you drop something onto the destination. Um, I'll close all these windows now. If you're interested in being one of three persons to win a free license of this app, just go to our website which is at macosxscreencasts.com search for the drop zone a blog entry and comment on it and you get the chance to win one of them so i hope you had fun watching this bye bye